Hey everyone, thank you so much for joining Power App Solutions in Minutes. I'm excited for you to be here. Uh, this is my newest launch. I'm returning to YouTube uh, in full force to create content for the Microsoft community. So with that being said, uh, here we are in the Microsoft 365 Admin Center, and this video is regarding licensing your users. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is click on this uh, left navigation pane item called users. And when I expand that, I'm gonna click on active users because I'm only interested in users that are going to be active, that are gonna be using the system. And then I'll click on this user right here, the only user I have in my database right now. And then I'll look at their licenses. So under this licenses and apps tab, what I'll do is I'll look at their licenses and see what they have. In this case, I can clearly see that uh, Alex has no licenses and zero apps as well. In this case, what I'll do is I'll check off the Dynamics 365 customer engagement plan. And what I'll also do is note that he's been given access to a variety of different apps. So he's got access to Power Automate, Power Apps, like Canvas apps or model-driven apps, got access to SharePoint uh, and a variety of other different modules. So those modules are gonna drive the rest of the videos that I'm gonna be creating here in the next uh, few days and uh, weeks. So I'm very excited for you to join me on this path of implementation. We're gonna implement our own system and this is the very, very beginning. The next video will be on solution management. So from here, go ahead and save your changes and you've now applied licenses and applications to your user. Your changes have been saved. We can now go ahead and close this. And we now can see that our user has the Dynamics 365 customer engagement or CE plan. So you're all set. Thank you for joining us and for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe or hit the like button.